it's Dr. Manali from If We're a Family. Today I'm going to be talking about if weight loss coaching really works. Now I haven't tried it myself, but I'm going to review what medical studies are available. Now um, the first thing is, is that medical studies do show that weight loss coaching is effective and it's most likely to be effective if you try it for at least six months. And it's less likely to be effective if you're trying it for shorter periods of time. And in addition, um, it's most likely to be effective if you speak with a coach two to four um, times a month, and that's online or in person. Um, but the frequency makes a difference too. The more frequently up to one week, like once a week, if you're talking to a coach, you're more likely to lose, less, uh, to lose more weight than somebody who's speaking with a coach less frequently. Then the next thing to consider is that, you know, um, one study also showed that it helped people maintain weight loss even after they um, had lost all the weight they wanted to, they were less likely to put the weight back on. So if you're one of those people who can lose weight on your own, but you always bounce back and forth, and you're not able to keep it off, weight loss coaching may help you as well, too, to actually keep that weight off once you've lost it. Now, sometimes weight loss coaching can be kind of expensive and the cost may be an issue, but I would think of it as an investment in your health. If you're losing weight by eating healthier and speaking with um, a weight loss coach, then that can help prevent long-term health problems like uh, high cholesterol and diabetes, or it can even help reverse those problems. So long-term, it can help you save money um, and that you have less health problems, hopefully, if you're able to lose weight effectively with a coach. So that's one thing to consider is that, you know, it's an investment in your health. And lastly, how long should you try it for? In these studies, um, people lost weight, you know, they were losing weight even in the first six months, um, 10 to 20 pounds. So I think that's a good period of time to consider is that if you're not losing weight with a program within the first six months, maybe you're not going to, um, because the same program's not gonna work for everyone. Um, different people have, you know, different lifestyles, different backgrounds. I would kind of think of it how you uh, learn best in school. For example, you know, if you were learn best in a group setting versus an individual setting or online versus in person, that may be telling to how you may lose weight more effectively too. So I would start with something like that, like however you like to learn best, maybe that's the best way for you to try to lose weight as well. And if one program doesn't work though, I would move on after six months if it's not you know effective, because again, you might have a different lifestyle than your friends who lost weight successfully with this program, or um, you may have a different background or even a different genetic background can make a difference. So those are all things to consider um, when you're trying to lose weight. That's all for today. For more videos, you can subscribe to my YouTube channel, Dr. Manali Desai, or follow me on Instagram, Healthy with Dr. Manali, or sign up for my email list if we're a family. I'll see you next time.